Alright, so, to, hello, today we are interviewing a bottle of smog that represents both Mexico City and the UK in their air pollution problem. Now, is it true that the word smog was invented to describe London? Well, that's what I understand, but I believe you're probably some sort of expert. Could you tell me more about it? Well, it was invented um, to describe London in the 20th century because it was a combination of smoke and fog which the UK had a lot of. Now, um, what was the Great London Smog? Oh, that. In 1952, London was so polluted that you could barely see through the smog. It was a most dreadful experience and it was one that hopefully spurred people to action. Right. Now, why is Mexico... City so well, they have, there's a very large population there, of Mexicans primarily. Um, combined with, they, they drive many cars and the surrounding mountains trap the smog. There's like a layer form, the air forms, different temperatures of layer form, a barrier of sorts that keeps the smog from escaping. Hmm. Now, what are the governments of the two countries doing to, um, regulate the air pollution? Well, in the UK, there are coal-free zones. I'm certain that they have regulations on auto and factory emissions as well. While in Mexico City, the government is trying to get people to ride the bus and the subway to reduce the use of cars. Hmm. Well, that's very nice. Thank you. Goodbye.